Hi, I'm Elizabeth and I'm Cindy and we're here with another feeding frenzy for the master key system and we are on part one, day 27. Hey, okay. you ready? I am. The consciousness that focuses in your brain cells is the same consciousness which focuses in the brain cells of every other individual. Each individual is but the individualization of the universal the cosmic mind. Wow. Do you believe that? Yeah. I do, but how come there's so there's many a but. stupid people in this world then? If they've all got the same mind. I'm serious. How can there be people that are extremely brilliant and then there are people that are so freaking it's as easy as are you awake or are you asleep? Have you used your potential or not? Okay. Do you say yeah. we're all one, and I can see that. Okay, I do too. I'm just joking. No, no, no. Still, that is just a really complicated way of saying we're all one, yeah. and we think of the same mind. We think with the same mind. But you did touch on something that's really interesting to look at. You know, when we see people with like birth defects, mm -hmm. those who are not able, we see, we mm -hmm. think are not able to think as clearly as we do, some that may have a mental illness, or um, I've even known those with an actual disability in the brain, mm -hmm. let's say a cerebral palsy, or a, right. where there's a disconnect somewhere. Mm -hmm. And you look at the difference between someone who's healthy and someone who has had some kind of defect, mm -hmm. and you think, how can we be the same? Right. There's a world of difference between the two of us. How can we be the same? Yeah. Well, another thing you made me think of as you were talking there is that um, I think it's Abraham Hicks who says our kids are born hardwired now to just understand the computers. Mm -hmm. You know, and I think there's this collective consciousness that, you know, if we were born, just think about it, if we were born and we had to learn everything that everybody's ever learned from day one mm -hmm. of the human race mm -hmm. till now. Mm -hmm. You know, we'd still be learning how to cook with wood and, you know, all that stuff. And then we'd have to get, you know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I do. And our kids, I mean, my kids know so much more oh, about they do. I mean, computers you, than we ever dreamed about when we were three year old. Age. Yeah. Who picks one up and just automatically goes to town. And you think, how did you know that? Mm -hmm. If we weren't all one, there is no way they could know that. They'd have to start from scratch, right. like you're saying. Yeah. But then that also speaks to disabilities. Mm -hmm. It's not necessarily, it's just a disconnect. Mm -hmm. To me, it's just a disconnect. Mm -hmm. May not have right. access to because well, of a block or whatever, but we still have the same potential. We're still mm -hmm. all one. And some of the people that we judge as disabilities, in my opinion, are probably higher than we are. Functioning. Autistic in and different children, areas. And, yeah. uh, for years we've seen them with deficiencies and in my mind I think they're probably the more in tune, more advanced. Mm -hmm. They've just learned to communicate a different way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's interesting stuff. So when we start tying the spiritual into the physical, which is what we're doing here, the inner into the outer, mm -hmm. combining the two, and it speaks more to my logical left brain. Does it yours? Do you find this helpful? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> it helps me look at others and see past the insufficiency or the disability or the disconnect or the whatever it is to mm -hmm. see. Wait a minute. We're, they're thinking with the same mind right. I am. We just may have a communication problem. You know, it helps me even with the X. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I'm saying? Right. We're just, there are times when I wonder if intellectually we're on the same plane, and I have to keep reminding myself we're one. That was a very nice way to put that. It was, wasn't it? <laughs> I told you I'm moving <laughs> to a higher road here. Uh, there are times when I wonder that, and I doing this helps me keep in the forefront we're one. We're using the same stuff here. It just there's a disconnect there. There's a problem with communication. There's a problem mm -hmm. elsewhere. Mm -hmm. Well, and and 
I was taught that you keep the spiritual separate from the day to day mundane mm -hmm. stuff. And I'm, I know a lot of people aren't taught that, but that's the way I was taught. And so for most of my life, I was trying to put God in this box and then the rest of my life in this box. Mm -hmm. And to keep them separate. And now, and to keep science separate from God, you know, that there was no mm. such thing as, yeah. as, you know, evolution and all that. And my brain, my left brain, kept saying, but it all has to work together at some point or we can't be in this space right. as one being if they don't combine somewhere. So this is helping me to see how the spiritual and the physical actually tie in together. Mm -hmm. And work and how the brain tandem. cells work with the spiritual and it all synergizes and works together. Mm -hmm. So that that's why I like this book. Mm -hmm. It's because it's not just all out there somewhere. It pulls it into the real world mm -hmm. for me. Mm -hmm. To our little R reality. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And let us know that the little R and the big R they do and mesh. They do come together at some they point. They do mesh. You mm -hmm. can't we can't live Without as both. one and have separate realities. Mm -hmm. it, if someone else could explain that to me, then please do, but I can't see it. Right. It's not something I can wrap my hand around. When I, we've got nothing but, we found nothing but evidence that it's a meshing mm -hmm. of the two. And that if there is a disconnect there, it's because of something we're not seeing from our right. perspective. Right. Right. You know? It doesn't make it any less true. Right. We just are ignorant to it. Exactly. Good stuff. Very good stuff. Yeah. Shame. Shame.